extra extra we're back with another entry and happy january 1st 2023 new year to you today's entry pertains to an entrepreneur billionaire a media proprietor and the owner of the dallas mavericks we're gonna kick this year off right and without further ado let's get into it mark cuban on the habit all 30 somethings need to succeed without it quote you're not expanding your mind end quote if you can't come up with a New Year's resolution, Mark Cuban has you covered. On Sunday, the Dallas Mavericks owner told Bill Meyer on the so-called Club Random podcast that everyone over 30 should be reading every day. Otherwise, they're limiting themselves and their career, he said. Quote, somebody 40 and over, even 30 and over. If you're not reading, you're fucked because you're not expanding your mind. End quote, Cuban said. Quote, I tell my kids. Somebody who doesn't read lives one life. Somebody who reads an unlimited number of lives, end quote. Turns out Cuban is on to something. A 2016 study conducted by Yale University School of Public Health researchers found reading 30 minutes a day helped participants 50 and older live on an average two years longer than their non-reading counterparts, regardless of health, wealth, gender, and education. Cuban himself is an active reader. In 2018, he told CNBC Make It he reads four to five hours per day studying national and local news, emails, and technology research. And seems Cuban's two older daughters picked up his affinity for reading, or at least they were bribed into it. When they were younger, both girls would be rewarded with, quote, shoes or whatever they wanted, end quote, after they read a certain number of pages, Cuban said. Then the family could have conversations about what they read. But Cuban said he had to adapt a different strategy for his son, now 13, who doesn't like to read. Cuban was worried his son's ambivalence towards books would, quote, hurt him long term, end quote, until he realized his son was learning in different ways. Quote, they consume a lot of information online, end quote, Cuban said, quote, the challenge wasn't so much are they learning. The challenge for me was understanding how they learn, end quote. After noticing his son was picking up business concepts like gross margins and royalties from watching YouTube and TikTok videos, Cuban realized the platforms could act as parenting tools. Quote, TikTok is the best parental tool in the world because it's artificial intelligence based off of what you watch. End quote. Cuban said on the podcast, quote, so if I want to know what my kids are into, I just look at their TikTok feeds. End quote. Over here at Jonda's Journal, we keep it funky like a pissy mattress. Yeah, man. Mark Cuban is giving game to people that are 30 plus. Look, man, have you ever got to a certain age and felt like it was a young man's game? Well, that's not true, according to Mark Cuban, baby. It's New Year's and this is the path and the direction you should take. If you want to know what rich people are into because you're broke, look at rich people. Study them. Yale's research of public health told you that people in the 50s read just 30 minutes a day and help them outlive their non-reading counterparts by two years. Man, that's a bunch of something right there. So now you see why we read over here at Jonda's Journal. This is one of the reasons I'm slowly getting you to read an article. You're going to come willingly or kicking and screaming with me. But anyway... This the part of the entry where we part ways, but you know what to do. Leave me a comment in the comment section because I value you guys' opinion. And if you if you talk to me, I still talk back, baby. Uh, what do you think about Mark Cuban suggesting reading to 30-somethings? Do you think it's valuable? Do you think it's a bunch of garbage? Hit that comment section and let me know something. Smash that notification bell to be notified every time we make an entry over here at John's Journal on YouTube. Hit the dislike button if you think reading is like that episode of The Twilight Zone, The Obsolete Man. Y'all go check that out. Hit the like button if you learned something. Hit the like button if you like today's commentary and content and put some of this ism in the algorithm. Don't just sit there looking stupid on my channel, baby. We don't condone that. Uh, if you want others to learn some of this game that you learned, hit the share button. I don't mind. As always, subscribe. It's a call to action. Until next time, peace. No Power To You LLC is my new brand. I branded myself in order to pass out liberation in the form of four ebooks. One link four ebooks each an hour long a piece to read learn about race relations in north america as well as abroad between white and black people with the no power to you presents the book of live series 
Learn about how to get out of a hard time and how to stay out of one with the No Power To You Presents Hell Hat The Nexus series. We the brand of liberation. We're playing no games. Go check me out on Amazon. Read, rate, and review.